Hey guys, Heidman here with the next episode of The Sims 4. I feel like saying back in action again, even though it's been like this in the day. So, for me, I don't know about you, but still, I'm feeling good. I just finished work, I got home, and I did some stuff for my mom, and now we're ready to go. And apparently she is the only one awake, so we're going to focus on her. Name, 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 name. Laurel. I believe we're working on this. Yep. Get that to level 10 and max body potential. Until either that happens or somebody wakes up or there's something else to do. Kind of like having the wall back there, to be honest. At least right now, anyway. <laughs> Let's go triple speed, shall we? Hey, somebody woke up. It's Manuel. I gotta start calling him by his name instead of the kid. Alright, we'll go ahead and let you pee. And we're gonna go get leftovers. And I automatically hear something I would rather not be hearing right now. Hold on. Okay, that's taken care of for now. Cora was chewing on my shoe rack. Naughty puppies. And she knew she was being naughty too. What did I do? I get leftovers. Alright, now she's awake. She needs to pee. Pee to pee pee. Go pee. Why is there an option of pranking toilet? I understand it's a mischief thing, but it just seems like a dick move. And also, apparently, she's going to need a shower afterwards by the looks of the needs on her thing. Oh, I love you too, puppies. You're not in trouble. You just need to not chew on stuffs, okay? You got plenty of bones and things to chew on, okay? Yes. Yes, I know you got teeth coming in. They hurt teeth. Yes. That's what the bones and stuff is for, though. Not the furniture. Or daddy's hand, for that matter. Okay. Okay, has this... Okay, that was fun. Uh, has this kid done his homework? Yep. I don't care about extra credit because he's an A student. He's as far as he can get in the drama club stuff. What do we need here? Draw all five pictures. He's done one, which means he has done shapes. Yep, shapes. I'm going to go ahead and throw that in his inventory for now. And we're going to draw... Let's go vehicle. Come back to her. I don't know what she's doing, but her social is quite low, so... Uh... I don't know why she wants to do that so much. But, since she has nothing else to do and she's not doing the exercise I told her to do. I mean, that makes more sense to me. Because I didn't tell her to do this, so she will stop doing it as soon as I do the woohoo option. So, what's this? Go for a jog. All right, I'm going to pin that. Buy a litter box. We don't own a cat. You owned a cat right before you moved out of your parents' home. And it was your sister's cat. I suppose we could adopt a cat. Uh, I'm at four. I'm planning on at least one, two more. So that would be... Six. At most, I plan on doing uh, okay, so seven. We are allowed to have eight, so I could adopt a cat. This one would be a full-grown cat, of course. And then I can purchase a for box. So I'll tell you what, we'll go ahead and do that. Work on rocket on rocket for one hour. Um, maybe. Let me guess from owning a rocket. 
from being focused. Hmm. Okay, then after this, you know what? Let's go ahead and do it. Let's, let's adopt a kitty. Maybe an old kitty, one that's already been trained. And is not going to be high energy. Okay, if you put beds in, you can get roommates, but I don't like that whole idea. Getting roommates that you can't control. Okay, so for now, we're going to be cat family, I think. I feel like a dog would be too much for this family anyway right now. Cat's good. I don't want you to adopt a kitty cat. Use the bathroom. I'm going to focus on her because it's going to bring up the list of cats. I guess male or female doesn't matter. My personal preference for adopting animals or getting pets is a girl. All my animals are girls. The one boy I had was very ill-behaved. Aww, Mia is a kitten. And that's my and that's Leia's mommy's name, even though Leia is a dog. Right. Kitten female spade. But I'd have to bring her to the to the vet to that machine in order to age her up once the skills were up. So I would prefer a cat I don't have to age up. So either an adult or an elder. What it says I I don't know what a core it is. It's cute though. These looks like they're the same breed, but according to this, this is a color point short hair, kitten female spade, nougat. Oh, I don't like the name though, but it, She's very pretty and white. That's, that's a female. I assume by the name and by the look, this was going to be a boy. Javanese, kitten, female, spade. They're all very adorable. Kitten, male, neutered. Nacho, sprig, kitten, male, no neutered. Brenda, adult, female, spade. She's a savannah. I like that. I really like the leopard print. Bobby is a Somali, adult, male, neutered. And Wallace is an adult male neutered. Balinese. Well, I like and dislike Brenda for the exact same reason. She looks like a little leopard. Right? And she's female, which is a bonus. But I also really do like Bobby and Wallace. I wish there was more information about them. I'm going to go Wallace and, and we'll see his personality type. Gonna say, can he scan for personality for a for a kitty? Does not look like it. But we'll try. Someone else can do it too, I think. I think she has the ability to figure things out upon introduction. So we will do both, because if for some reason she doesn't get information on the cat from introducing herself to the cat, maybe the robot can scan it. It's very cute. It's actually a little bit fluffier than I wanted. I'm gonna beat his ass, okay. So can I nope that's not still going. Yabasan family. Band trip Aragaba. Here Koi Ref Sieg. Yeah, I'm full step. Oh, um you. Yeah.
Yeah, not helpful. If it works for cats, like it does people. Curious, glutton, and affectionate. Huh. These cats are more curious about their surroundings. They like to search different objects around the house. These pets will eat significantly more often and much more messily in a Affectionate is good. Ah, uh, curious is and I'm not fond of glutton. Affectionate is great though. Uh, can I choose to not adopt? Uh, more choices. Actions? No. Pet care? No. Friendly? No, mean. I don't want to shoo it, because, yeah, that's mean. Um, can I tell him I don't want the kitty cat? Okay, I guess we're going to go with friendly introduction to him and see what I can do. If I don't want it, do I go to the computer and uh, check out another cat? And adoption evaluation. Oh, it's on the table. I'm not fond of that either. Can you go away now? I said end adoption evaluation. That means you leave now. Yes, you take that and leave. It's, it's a cute cat. He's not a bad cat. Just wasn't really what I was going for. They should give you the information about the cat. On the adoption page, right? They know this information, so therefore you should be allowed to know this information. Instead of being like, okay, let's see what we got. All right, and they're all the same cats. Uh, let's try Bobby. I don't remember if I was having her not go to work for any reason. Right, but go here instead of doing that. And the cat's already on the table. Not overly fond of that option. But I think all cats are going to wind up on the table. The kitten didn't because it was a kitten. But I don't want a permanent kitten. I like his appearance better, even. Free 
Spirit Prowler Talkative. Well, let's check that out. Relationship. Bobby opens in profile. Okay. Free Spirit. These cats enjoy wandering around the world, almost as if they were wild animals. But don't worry, they'll always come home for the food. Hmm... I both like and dislike that. These cats love to yell along with other sims. We even try to sing. That one's cute. And Prowler, I don't know. I'm in the way again. Okay. These cats enjoy prowling around the neighborhood. Send them out and they might come back with something they found. So a prowler and free spirit fit hand in hand. And then there's talkative. That's reasonable. Uh oh, skimbo. <laughs> uh -huh. But I want to check out the other one. Right. Do I have to end it twice? Okay, let's check out Brenda, I guess. Okay, we're going to check out Brenda, just to see her personality. Bobby is an interesting one. He is very free-spirited. You don't have to do much for him. But I also don't overly like the concept of them just wandering the neighborhood all on their lonesome. I wish I would have known that. Go here. There's Bobby. Where are Wallace and Brenda? Uh, uh, you're on a raft. <laughs> All right, there's Brenda and Wallace. Okay, so we are gonna friendly introduction to Brenda. Man, I wish I would have known I could have had all three come at the same time. Oh, <laughs> Free spirit, glutton, fluffy. Well, there's that glutton bit again. More choices, actions, opens in profile. So this one will wander the neighborhood as well. And is a glutton, but is fluffy. And, oh, so they had a couple more hairballs. It's like the worst of both worlds. Okay, Bobby, you win. We'll use a full-grown kitty cat, so... No, not Bobby Edge. It's going to be... Do I give a last name to a cat? Yeah, why not? Technically, I, I feel like my animals have my last name, but I've never officially put it on there. Okay, I've chosen Bobby. We can now end the adoption evaluation. 
Hakyoin Limla? Ah, huh. Kibaya! Okay, I'm gonna... <laughs> Don't know what the hell happened there. Okay, I'm gonna tell her to get leftovers. And then I'm gonna go into build mode. And get kitty stuff. Kitty kitty meow meow. Kitty kitty meow. Kitty kitty meow meow. Kitty 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 meow. Okay, object by room. See, no, that's pet bowls. You know what? We're gonna do this. We're gonna objects by function. Yes, objects by function. Come on. Come on. Come on now. There we go. Pets. Pet care. We shall do the feeder. Let's do red. This should go somewhere by the kitchen. Hmm. I'm gonna put it there and I'll move something else soon for that to work better. Okay, a pet bed. We can have one there, near the fire. Obviously we want more. Near the fire, behind the couch, that's it for this floor. Um, don't understand why it can't be under the stairs. But as close to under the stairs as possible. I don't see any likelihood of it needing to go up on the roof or anything. Oh, why not? It can lounge on the roof. Preferably away from the rocket. Here we go, on the other side of the... There, in the corner back there. Nice little sleepy-by place for it. And now the self-cleaning litter box. What colors do we have? I like the purple one. Not right next, but I don't want it no, too close to there either. Um, what about... 
Yeah, I think that's good enough. I know you don't need multiple litter boxes, right? I am perfectly aware of this. However, it would be nice to have be a, have it be allowed to go on every single floor. Especially considering the fact it is a self-cleaning litter box. I don't know if I can get in that there. It would be the best place for it, though. So that's where it's going to go. Whether or not I can actually use it, I don't know. I don't overly care. It has multiple other options. Seems reasonable enough. No. Now we're gonna go back to by function. Okay, it's still there. Pets. I think that was it for pet care. Yeah. A food dish, some beds, and a th and litter boxes. Pet toys. Are there any of these where the paw print turns into a fishy? No. I find this one weird. Yeah, it's a brown cat. That's similar. Yeah, I don't like those. Okay, now the cat toy box can be in one location. Will not be down here though. Will it be up here? Oh, actually, got a perfect little corner to put that into. Okay. You put that there, and we'll grab one of these, and we'll put it right there for now until I can put them in the box. You know you gotta have the nice cat condo, right? Start down here. Well, the cat condo is the only thing here I'm going to go for, so I'll, I'll just copy and paste. I'm not going for any of that. Oh, and show all. Okay, so the cat condos are the last thing I plan on having, so now we're going to copy. I don't want it behind the couch because the fireplace is be right on it. Can't really put it here. I 
I mean, that would be kind of way, kind of in the way of the stairs. That'll work. I don't know if the cat will have a thing up here. There's really not enough room for a cat thing up here. Right, the robot's not gonna want, I mean, the servo, Phoenix isn't gonna want one in his room. There's not enough room in the kid's room. Plus there's a bed for it if it wants to. It is more than free though to have one on the, on the roof. Okay, live mode. Yeah, I was gonna say. Okay, can we get into the point where I'm, where you're letting me do stuff now? Okay. Ah, oh, crap. Although now, I, I was going to try to put it back here. All right, I was going to move this. But I can't move that to where I wanted it to go anyway. And I was going to put that back there, but I don't even know if I could access it. So now... Since this thing's here anyway... There. Now back into live mode yet again. And now that we own a kitty cat, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.